Welcome back to my little channel. Yes, 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 the forest is out. <laughs> We're going to talk about the foolishness of the environment. And this one is particularly foolish. Now, by now, we all have heard how green solar panels and wind turbines are, right? I mean, they're the most green of, of solutions when it comes to electricity. But are they really? Well, yeah, um, one might argue that. Because a landfill begins burying the non-recyclable wind turbine blades. But weren't we promised that everything was recyclable? And even then, I mean, let's be honest, some of the stuff that is recyclable, it takes so much energy and it's so much pollution from recycling these things but apparently not everything is recyclable so yeah they're going to bury the wind turbine blades as if it, that's not bad enough npr reports researchers estimate that the us will soon have to grapple with over 720,000 tons of blades in the next 20 years a figure that doesn't include newer, taller, and higher capacity versions. And they all need to be dealt with. And dealing with them means burying them. Because they'll take hundreds of years to biodegrade and we can't do anything else with them. Am I the only one who's like, this, this is not what it said on the packaging? This is not how they promised it would end up. But yeah, I know, I know. How dare we question our ecological betters. Once again, they spin the red herring and we follow it blindly. No, not blindly, gladly. Let's be honest, you can't find follow something blindly. It's very difficult. Oh, and for all of, you, all of you people who don't understand the, the thingy, a red herring is something you spin to train falcons in hunting. Yeah. And then they capture it, and it's only a red herring, so they can't really say they captured anything. But uh, they had a nice chase. And this is um, what seems to be happening with the whole global warming and environmental bullshit. Oh no, yeah, we're going to go for green energy. Look at us going for green energy. Well, yeah, um, we're going to pollute a little bit because, yeah, some of the things we make, some of the things we use can't really be recycled. But yeah, no, it's not that much. It's only about 720,000 tons in the US alone. The, the wind energy is, is, is the next best thing. Funny enough, nuclear is um, by far cleaner and it has less waste than this, to be honest. And that waste can be dealt with in a slightly better way than it's already being done anyway, because let's be honest, if we take thorium salt reactors, we can burn existing nuclear waste which will give us some more energy out of it and it will take their half-life from several thousand years to a hundred years and we know how to store shit for a hundred years and we're not having to store 720,000 tons seriously can we get away with these um, idiots and, and, and tell them get the fuck out of our sight you're destroying our world by trying to be green. But then again, the road to hell is paved with good intentions. And this clearly seems to be just that. Anyway, criticism as always is more than welcome. I look to hear what you think. I'm looking forward to your criticism. And I hope to see you all next time.